Hey everybody, welcome to the online session of Manula Classes. My name is Brijesh and I am the English faculty at Manula Classes. In today's session, I'm going to talk about what CLAT is, what is the eligibility that is required to appear in this examination, what are the syllabus, what is the CLAT of, where you can apply, and what is the question pattern for 2022. And there are some best colleges also in this list itself. So watch the video till the end so that you can be benefited of all the information that is given here. But before we begin, let me tell you the admissions for one year and two year programs are open. If you want to know more about our programs, you can visit us at www.lawandressindia.com. You can also call us at 9971444054 in order to know about CLAT, what CLAT is. If you want to uh, get some counseling, how should you go about CLAT, and anything you want to know about CLAT and other law entrance examination as well, we are there for you. Our representatives will be happy and more than happy to help you. So, all right, everybody, here we come with what CLAT is. Aise bahut sare students hain jinne abhi bhi CLAT ke baare mein nahi pata. They do not know what CLAT is. Kya kar sakte hain law ke field mein? Unhe bas pata hai ki lawyer bante hain. Kaise pata hai? Wo apne peers se, apne friends se jante hai, but still there are some students who, who do not know what CLAT is. So in this video, I'm going to talk about everything from the, uh, you can say the from the scratch to the uh, top level uh, where you can apply and till what uh, position you can go and all these things we will be discussing in this session itself. So what is CLAT? CLAT जो है वो दो तरीके के एग्जाम कराता है. Let me be clear at the first slide itself कि CLAT UG and CLAT PG. So in this video I'm going to talk about only CLAT UG that is CLAT undergraduate, not CLAT PG. All right. The full form of CLAT is Common Law Admission Test. It is basically a national level entrance that you can see on the screen that screens students and aspirant to take admission in the undergraduate law program, right? Which is uh, conducted by uh, NLUs for their UG program. This exam ke liye ke wo log eligible hai jino ne 10 plus 2 pass kar liya hai ya to wo appearing hai. So we will be discussing in detail what eligibility, what are some extra requirement is needed, what are your percentage and all those things. So I hope ki slides aapko samaj mein aagya ho ki CLAT hota kya hai. CLAT ka full form hai common law admission test jo ki 5 year ke program mein aapko entry deta hai NLUs mein. So, as a bohas are universities, hai jo CLAT ke marks pe aapko admission deti hai. So, aapko subse pele kya karna hoga, CLAT ke exam ko fill karna hoga, form ko fill karna hoga, usme appear hona hoga, and you have to have uh, good marks taki aapka CLAT ho jaye. And if in case CLAT nahi ho pa raha hai, so there are other universities as well jo ki aapko admissions deti hai. All right, so 10 plus 2, no age bar, aage hum detail mein discuss karte hai. So let's talk about the eligibility for undergraduate program of CLAT. CLAT PG ke liye aap samaj sakte ho ki aapko law graduate hona chahiye. But here in this video, we are only talking about CLAT UG program. So sabse pehle aap dekh sakte ho, point number one says that there is no upper age limit. So iska kya matlab hai ki koi bhi vekti CLAT mein baat sakta hai, he should have passed 12th or is in appearing. 12th all right so next point says that you you have to have 45 percent marks or equivalent grade if you want to uh, if you are if you come from uh general obc and other these categories which has been mentioned in the slide this information has been taken from clack consortium website itself and 40 percent marks or equivalent grade for in case of you are from scst categories so this is all about the uh, percentage that you need in your 12th examination people who are appearing 12th also they can also sit for this examination so appearing candidate in qualifying examination either your examination is in march or april 2022 you are eligible but in case you are selected you have to produce the result that yes you have passed 12 plus 2 all right 
keeping the uncertainty in, in mind uh, due to this covid situation government may, uh, will always come up with some conclusion so abhi se aap ye mat socho ki exam nahi hua exam late hua to kya karenge now just focus on taking examination because you are not the sole person jise problem hogi when the problem is in general to uska koi ek conclusion nikalti hai government and consortium itself so abhi aapka kaam hai keval aap clat pe फोकस करे एग्जाम पे फोकस करे और राइट तो अभी क्वेश्चन आता है ठीक है सर हम जान गए ये मेरी एलिजिबिलिटी है नाउ व्हाट टू डू हाउ टू अप्लाई वेयर टू अप्लाई सो सबसे पहले जब आप अप्लाई करना चाहते हो आपको क्लैट कंसोर्शियम की विजिट करनी होगी वेबसाइट जस्ट टाइप सी एल ए टी ऑन गूगल इट विल लीड टू दी वेबसाइट दैट इज कंसोर्शियम ऑफ एन एल यूज एंड दिस इज दिंक फॉर दैट All right. आप इस पे जाते हो जस्ट टाइप योर मोबाइल नंबर एंड क्रिएट योर ओन पासवर्ड एंड यू विल बी रीडायरेक्टेड टू फॉर्म इट सेल्फ ऑल राइट अभी बात कर लेते हैं हम कुछ कि कट ऑफ क्या जाते हैं उसकी मार्किंग सिस्टम कैसे होता है एग्जाम का मोड क्या होते हैं सो बेसिकली देर विल बी वन फिफ्टी क्वेश्चन containing one each mark okay so ek number ka ek question hota hai aapke samne and jo aapko duration di jati hai wo 2 hours ki di jati hai that is 120 minutes so aap ye calculate kar sakte ho ki aapke paas 1 minute bhi nahi hai ek question ko solve karne ke liye all right so your preparation should be in a way ki aapne bas exam mein baitha itne sare aap mock pehle se de do sectional test topic test itna zyada attempt kar lo that you are quite confident when it comes to the examination right in addition to what i just said that there is negative marking as well so agar aapne kuch galtiyan kari hain aur aapko question nahi aate the so there will be a deduction of 0.25 marks that has been mentioned before so yadi hum exam ki baat kare exam mode ki baat kare to ye exam offline hua jata hai pen and paper mode mein halaki uh, 2020 mein covid ki situation ko dekhte hue inhone fir se computer based karaya hua tha but in 2021 they have taken it in uh, pen and paper based but aapko center pe jana hota hai iske liye so this was some information and cut off jo hota hai basically iska 90 plus jata hai so make sure that if you are attempting uh, at least uh, 115 questions to ye ek acha attempt ho ga but make sure that you are preparing hard because there are some students who are ruthlessly preparing about this examination right and uh, so let's talk about the syllabus and the exam pattern so you can see that there are five subjects that come in clat examination that is english language current affair and gk legal reasoning that is legal aptitude itself and then logical reasoning which will uh, which will include analytical reasoning and critical reasoning as well and then quantitative techniques or quantitative aptitudes more are same isme aapko bahut tarike ke questions aate hain they have like uh, revamped their examination pehle jo hai wo con conventional type ke questions aaya karte the but now they have introduced passage based questions from 2020 onwards so 2020 mein unhone passage based question ko laya hai jiske wajah se the exam became so lengthy but trust me this doesn't give a lot of effect to the preparation because uh, let me tell you an ex with an example ki agar ek topic lete hain defamation and if you have clarity what defamation is how it is being done and what are some rules regarding it so even even though if it has been asked in a form of mcq or in a form of passage you are quite sure about that all right so with uh, in any case agar aap se passage based mein koi cheez puch raha hai ya koi unconventional type mein puch raha hai the common thing is that you need to have clarity about that particular topic but i would say ki reading comprehension aapki itni achhi honi chahiye and english mein command itna acha hona chahiye ki when you read a passage of 450 words और 300 वर्ड्स एक बार में आपने पढ़ा चीजों को फेच करा इन्फॉर्मेशन को फेच करा एंड आफ्टर दैट यू स्टार्ट आंसरिंग द क्वेश्चन क्योंकि आपके पास इतना टाइम नहीं होता है सो मेक श्योर कि अभी से ही आप प्रिपरेशन में इतना जोर लगाएं एंड हैव अ लॉट ऑफ मॉक टेस्ट विथ यू जिससे कि आपकी प्रैक्टिस बहुत अच्छी हो जाए so you can see on the screen that there will be एस्टिमेटेड ऑफ ट्वेंटी टू क्वेश्चन बिटवीन पिछले साल में uh, Six passages आए थे, they were followed by thirty questions. So one passage will be followed by five questions. ठीक है, so six passages उन्होंने English में लिया हुआ था, and then you can see current affair में इन्होंने seven passages लिए हुए थे, followed by again thirty five questions, and then uh, similarly legal reasoning they have taken eight passages and followed by five questions. 
each passage. All right, so total 40 questions there. And then logical reasoning, six passages followed by 30 questions. And then three passages on maths. Maths may they have introduced data interpretation. This may keep tabular form mein, chart form mein, pie chart form mein, kisi bhi form mein, aapke saamne data ko represent karte hain, and then they ask you to uh, give the information, they will also be passage based questions. So make sure that level of exam is uh, difficult, I would say, and you cannot take this exam lightly. No one, no any exam has been meant to take lightly, but here in this case, your preparation is necessary because if you are weak at English at any way, so make sure that you are not going to understand understand the passage and if you did not understand the passage how are you going to answer the question right so make sure that starting from the beginning english se hi taiyari hoti hai aapki and conceptual clarity of different topics let's say when you are going to law you have law of thought you have multiple topics there you should have clarity on each topic law of contract again the same case ipc again the same case then you come to critical reasoning you need to have that critical attitude in you right and it comes when you practice mocks a lot. So this was about syllabus and exam pattern. So there will be 150 questions containing each mark one. So total 150 marks also. So let's talk about important events. First January 2022, they have examination form ko la diya hai apne website pe. so you can log in to their website by creating their, your own credentials and fill, fill up the form. Right, and then you can uh, see the deadline for the exam is 31st March. So do not wait for the last moment. Ki last time I got up, I'm going to go to the first come first serve. Wala option be here, rakte hai, jab aapko center choice ki baat aati hai. So do not get late. Abhi se hi varna suru kar do form ko. All right, last moment may if you will be thinking ki boards are going to there will be so many hassle. So avoid hassle. Take more, take a moment, take a day and start filling up the form with, uh, with the documents which are required during the form filling. All right, so the examination date so far is. 8th of May, so you cannot uh, say that it will be uh, postponed, but uh, keeping the uncertainties in mind, it might postpone. But as of now, it is 8th May. So your preparation should not be like, uh, you do not have to worry about date. You just have to worry about your preparation. How much preparation is done? And in case date is there, then you have to worry about it. So, you have to worry about it. 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 They have uh, calculated this thing that in the heat COVID jada prevail hota hai. So what they did, unhone December mein hi CLAT 2023 ko uh, rakha hua hai, jo ki 2022 mein hi liya jayega. So CLAT 2023 will take place on 18th December 2022 itself. All right, 2022. Ye 2023 mein nahi hona hai. 2022 mein hi inhone CLAT 2023 ke liye six month advance mein hi inhone entrance exam kara dena hai. So those students who are appearing this year will have another chance in the December itself. So aapke saath back to back do examination hai aapke liye CLAT 2022 ka jo ki 8th May ko hai and, and CLAT 2023 ka jo ki isi saal December mein 18th December ko scheduled hai. All right, so let us talk about some of the best colleges when you sit in the CLAT examination and made it to NLU. So, sabse pehla avsar aapke paas aata hai, that is NLSIU Bangalore, jise ki NIRF ne number one ranking dehi hui hai, uske baad you have NLU Hyderabad, you have an LU Kolkata, Gandhinagar, Jodhpur, Bhopal, and Lucknow. So these are some uh, universities which are top ranked under CLAT. You can go to that. Uske alawa, you have a body hoti hai, ALIT, A I L E T, All India Law Entrance Test, which is NLU Dwarka, Delhi. Ke liye bana hua hai. So this is a different form fill hota hai that you can fill out and uh, take the test simultaneously which is with your preparation ke saath saath hi ho jata hai if you are preparing hard. All right. So <clears throat> I hope we have discussed everything about CLAT, what CLAT is, what are some eligibilities which are required, what is the exam pattern, syllabus, cut, cut off, and all the relevant information which has been given in this video.
So I would request you to uh, share this video to as many people as you want, and this will be helpful to them whenever they are going to start their preparation for CLAD. You can follow us on YouTube for our regular lectures, which are being conducted by top faculties of India. Also, you can refer to our Telegram channel for complimentary passages. This may have per day a passage dalte hai, and then in the evening we provide you some answers to that is again complimentary. You can follow us on Facebook and Instagram for our regular updates. All right. So I hope this video was helpful to you. Stay tuned for more such videos. Thank you. Thank mm -hmm. you.